to get into the recovery. Now, I'm not sure if that's actually going to work, but we're going to try. Now, how you do this is you hit control F11 after. There it is. So, let's just immediately... Um, keyboard failure. Uh-oh. It's not good. Darn it, it... Oh! Oh! Yes! It worked! Yes! It did something! Well, oh my god! I thought I did... Oh my god. Well... So yeah, uh... That... I, I didn't... Oh my god! Apparently I should just hold down the keys next time. Sorry. Anyway... Let's hit restore and yeah, it's immediately... Immediately gonna get going. Portion all data on the computer will be lost. If you wish to proceed, click the confirm button below. Click the cancel button below to exit the reboot without making changes to your computer. This, will, this process will take several minutes to complete. When the completion window is the finish button. And this is basically uh, the uh, last chance to uh, turn back, but well, yeah, I'm gonna hit confirm. <laughs> Volume and while well, we got this funny little cursor. Oh, yeah, so yeah, this was running in uh, this uh, system recovery process was successful. Collision, do not manually shut down your computer quickly. The finish button to reboot Windows, and yeah, that took pretty quickly. That went by pretty quickly. So, yeah, I'm gonna hit finish and click yes to continue. And yeah, that was running on Windows 98, by the way, so yeah. And yeah, you can see that it's probably gonna need to do more stuff. Oh, fell. End user license uh, agreement. Or soccer. Pre press any key on the keyboard uh, to, you know, so we're gonna enter. So yeah, important to technical support information. Uh, this stuff, uh, let's just check. Well, that's not the information that is just shown on the computer, so yeah. So that likely means that this is recovery media from a different thingy, but well, doesn't really matter too much. I think it some, had something along the lines of like Dimension 2400C, but yeah, we are booting into Windows XP now. It's gonna need to, is it going to tell me, is it gonna have to do more stuff? Mm, that's what I'd like to know. <clears throat> We've got ourselves a uh, thingy here. Please wait. Okay. How long do I need to wait here? A minute? An hour? I don't know. I do know, so this is taking quite a bit of time, so well. Yeah, oh, display settings. Uh... Oh, wait, we need to focus on the window. Oh, no, we need to hit the button. But yeah, it's gonna tell us to just something with the display resolution. Because this is a very low resolution. But yeah, I think we're in the outer box experience here. Oh, no, it's not. What? Uh, oh wait, this gotta take this has to be more of course. Microsoft Windows, please wait. Because yeah, there's more stuff to do. Oh, so this is the uh, uh license agreement. What Oh, is this, is this what the out-of-box experience is supposed to be? Is this the out-of-box experience? Uh, 
What? Should be rebooting. Yep. Mm. Well, I guess that's the out-of-box experience. <laughs> and that was 10 minutes. Including a bit of an, a technical problem. So, well, yeah. Welcome to the found new hardware wizard. No, not this time. What's the display resolution we're running in? Properties, cancel. Oh my goodness, everything is showing up. Get out of here! 640 by 480. And 16-bit color. Get out of here, McAfee. We don't... <laughs> I've got some of the drivers. So let's go to the... Um, let's go find those drivers. This device can perform it faster. No, thank you. I need... If I can hit documents, well, yeah. Oh, my goodness. This is... My computer... Oh, no. Not the found new hardware. Copy these over. I, 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 just copy... For now, I'll probably delete them later. I am going to now eject this uh, thingy. See what this one is. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. It's not responding. Processes. And <laughs> oh my guys. Uh, okay. Now get out of here. We need to reboot the system now. That's... That's a... Uh, yeah, I'm... Now, I'm not going to delve into all the software on here. I'm... This is the chipset driver. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and extract this. And, and of course, it's going to have to... Uh... Of course, it's gonna appear in like, you know, what, yeah, we got one of those icons. Yes, we want to. I'm going to cancel because of the fact that we got this set up here. Yes. Next, installing the chipset driver. And we're gonna restart the computer. Again. Now I don't have all the drivers uh, at the moment, so I'm gonna have to go. Uh oh, I do not care about that stuff. Get out of here, get out of here. Go beat yourself to the ground, you stupid thingies. I do not care. Still no proper thingies, so we're gonna go to my documents. Run. Continue. Yeah, I want to...
Yeah, I want to do this. Uh, installing this. Now, with the audio, it doesn't matter too much because we got a PC speaker in here. Oh, uh, we got... It. Get out of here. I'm installing a driver. Well, this doesn't seem as, a. Uh, you know, so... Of course, my entire thing is gonna get blocked out. I do not care! Properties, thank you. Oh my god. Cancel! Cancel! Yes, I want to do this. And, well, yeah. So an insight of what software comes on here, we got a word perfect office 12. Got real player, quick time, internet printing system, music match jukebox, McAfee, Java, so we got the paint shop pro, got your good old support stuff. You got some driver resources, some express services, some all that stuff. You got I, you got AOL, uh, and you know all this stuff. Also, I forgot to mention there's Plus Story too, a networking guide. You know, just why not try this out? Let's see what's on this. So this is a uh, two computers. Um, Windows 98. So yeah, that seems like a good old guide to get online. So I forgot that there's Adobe Reader 6. You also have uh, this Express Service Code thingy, which shows you the uh, thingy. You got a, re a driver reset, and we also have this uh, recovery tool. I already made one. You also have the Start Media Experiencing thingy. Uh-oh, it's one of these things. No, 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 no. Back. Mm. Quit DMX only. So this seems like a... This seems like a uh, media center thing. Oh, applications are on here. This is an online showcase. But yeah, that seems like, you know... And we have Dell support, and there's also the owner's manual. How long would it take to get the Dell support thingy to show up? I accept the uh, thingy. Um... But yeah, it's so, so this is recovery media from a Dimension 2400, as is shown here. Okay, so also Dell Picture Studio. Basically, it's just a uh, way to uh, launch these uh, programs. And then there's the Owner's Manual, which opens up in Adobe Reader uh, 6. Yeah, this is a uh, Mia for a Dimension 2400, which is aesthetically nearly identical to the 3000. So, uh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm just gonna shut this down, and yeah. So with that, thanks for watching. I will see you next week. Bye!